water is a fundamental element for human survival and uh, during the centuries we can find uh, many examples of the sedimentation of uh, an important uh, hydraulic uh, heritage as we can see here in Venice but also in many other parts of the Mediterranean and of the world that uh, uh, today may constitute uh, an important uh, element, an important asset also for uh, uh, tourist purposes. Um, according to a famous uh, art historian, uh, Simon Schama, waterways are one of the most uh, uh, important uh, iconic theme in both uh, literature and the landscape painting. And uh, uh, we want to focus exactly on waterways, that is to say artificial canals that has been used for centuries for human prosperity, not only for human survival, but uh, has been used for, uh, for troops, for transporting goods, uh, for trades, also in a huge territory uh, beyond uh, Venice, beyond uh, uh, what we can see uh, today in Venice. Uh, this uh, heritage is an important uh, element for tourist purposes. Sometimes it has been abandoned for centuries, but uh, for, for uh, a perspective of sustainable tourism, uh, we can find uh, many experiences in Europe of uh, regeneration, of uh, landscape and territorial regeneration. And uh, as uh, uh, Civiltà dell'Acqua, uh, that is Water Civilization Center, the association I represent, we developed during the last years a number of projects related to waterways, artificial canals, rivers, that penetrate into the territory and that has been uh, the source of uh, um, prosperity for many centuries. Today we have this sedimentation of uh, castles, uh, villas, mills, uh, ports, river ports, that uh, are um, important uh, to promote a sustainable tourism. And one of the projects we developed is exactly uh, uh, related to this uh, for a number of digital itineraries into what uh, may be considered in part an abandoned landscape today, but uh, which may be an important opportunity for the future. We can also see that in many parts of Europe, uh, such as in the uh, United Kingdom, uh, France and Germany, waterways has been at the center of many policies for a regeneration of the landscape and territory. And in the Veneto region, we developed together with the uh, Foscari Venice University, a project to uh, uh, promote uh, uh, traditional waterways, uh, the ways in which Venice was connected to important cities like Padua, like Treviso, like Portogruaro, even Milan for centuries uh, could be reached through navigation and through navigation along rivers but also artificial canals. And what is today part of this abandoned heritage has, has been at the center of our project of uh, re-evaluation for sustainable tourism. We focus on a number of digital itineraries which are available through uh, apps, apps uh, uh, that may, may be downloadable for free uh, from Apple Store, from Google Play Store, and that invite the tourists to uh, discover another Venice, not the most uh, uh, known part of Venice, not this kind of canals or ri, as they are uh, called in the Venetian language, but the waterways that penetrate into the inland. So we made um, a project aimed at make a census of this uh, heritage, hydraulic heritage, that is at the center of our project. We, um, we, we developed itineraries to discover villas, uh, castles, uh, ancient mills, ports, fortified towns that in the past were at the center of, of this network along the navigable canals. And uh, uh, we also participated to uh, an international competition at the 29th uh, uh, World Canals Conference. And uh, for this project, which is aimed to develop sustainable tourism, we were awarded with the Innovation Award. 
uh, in this prestigious uh, setting for, by this prestigious conference, uh, which means that also uh, places that today are in part abandoned are important for the future policies to regenerate territories, to give the opportunities to local people to uh, further strengthen their sense of place and to, to let also tourists uh, to discover new parts with, of Venice, which are part of the Venetian heritage. Water is a fundamental element for waterways, but has been used also for different purposes, for irrigation in agriculture, for um, um, uh, industrial and proto-industrial uh, uses. And uh, uh, as part of this project, uh, we developed uh, also another project, which is very much related to sustainable tourism, which is the global network of water museums. Uh, so we discovered during this project that uh, the entire territory is a kind of open air museum where we can discover the, through uh, the red thread of water, a way of narrating and discovering all our heritage. And uh, in this sense, uh, the entire territory is part of this uh, uh, water museum, which could be also exploited for tourist purposes. Uh, in this sense, we organized uh, with the UNESCO Venice office uh, last uh, spring, the first meeting uh, of uh, the global network of water museums, which try uh, to um, uh, make a link among the main institutions around everywhere around the world that uh, are trying to promote their uh, water heritage, their liquid heritage. So we can see that in different parts of the world, from Africa to China uh, to Asia, everywhere we have uh, water civilizations that try to uh, um, uh, develop a specific use of water. Water management models, uh, hydraulic heritage are part of what today may be uh, used for a strategy of sustainable tourism and sustainable development. And uh, with this global network of, of water museums, uh, we are trying to federate a number of these museums uh, in order to promote a new sense of water, a new ethical value of water. After this first meeting, we had uh, a presentation in Paris at uh, UNESCO International Hydrological Program. This project uh, has been endorsed by uh, IHP Bureau and uh, in the next uh, June uh, should be formalized by the Intergovernmental Council of IHP, International Hydrological Program, as a project to consolidate a, a new vision for water um, uh, civilization, for water uses, for water management, uh, uh, in order to get uh, closer to the Agenda 2030 and the Sustainable Development Goals of the United Nations.